Ludmila, I'm home. The dictator, the new president, has won the people's vote of confidence through unprecedented measures. In his latest speech, he announced the increase of the minimum wage by 70%. For millions of people, the Christmas celebrations turn to feasts as the increased income brings a complete life change for them. The measure has also put an end. Increasing the minimum Often called a dictator, the new president has won the people's vote of confidence through unprecedented measures. In his latest Damn. speech, he announced I should find a new light bulb. Wage by 70%. For of this is the place where my mother took her life. As the increased income brings a complete life change for them, the measure has also put an end to the protests organized by the opposition, who are still outraged by another decision by the president. Closing the borders. As you may know, the decision was taken earlier this month, and as a consequence, no one can... So I understand that we have five more minutes. You look a little rough, old boy. I hate to break this to you, but you fit perfectly in this old, decrepit place. Everyone knows about his past. Yeah, this is important that's because you, you'll certainly meet him. How on earth can you eat this thing? It looks like it's stood here for days. The stench is overwhelming. What the hell, Ludmilla? That blue building with the golden roof that cost us, the taxpayers, a fortune. This man... I will not call him a priest. Started... Hello? Lazarus, you finally arrived. Yes, a few moments ago. I thought you'd be home. Where are you? I'm beside her mother. Are you still at the cemetery? You should hurry up and catch a bus or else... Don't worry, I can handle it on my own. Listen, I brought you money. Enough to start a new life somewhere else. I want you to know that I am very sorry. There's no need to be sorry. I have forgiven you already, Lazarus. We all make mistakes from time to time. I have my own sense. Oh, thank you. Listen, you should hurry up. It's cold and dark already. By the way, where are you calling from? Ludmilla? Are you still there? Hello? on this wall, and a foul stench is coming from behind. This is madness. She even locked the bathroom door. What the hell is this thing? Losing my mind? What the devil was that? I should call the police right away. Hello, what's your emergency? You need to send someone. There's a creature in my bathroom. A hideous monster. Something like... Sir, please calm down and try to speak louder. I can't speak louder. The thing is right next to me. Just behind the door, there's a horrible thing there. The earthquake must have caused it to come out. It's sticking out of the toilet, and there's there's black stuff smeared on the walls. Please send someone. Okay, I'm going to ask you to calm down and back away from the door. Try to arm yourself with a knife if possible. Are you kidding? It's a bloody monster. How would a knife help me? Damn you, just send someone. Oh God, it's happening again. Please calm down. You are not the only emergency. There are reports from all over the city about abnormal activities and strange occurrences. You are not our first priority. No, 
No! Damn you! Somebody help me open this damned door! 